Hi guys, I am Jigvinder and in this video, we are going to learn how to create a Wi-Fi hotspot in Windows 8 or Windows 8.1 laptop. With the help of this hotspot, you can share the internet connection of your laptop with other wireless devices like tablets, smartphones and laptops. Let us discuss the prerequisites and activities we are going to perform on this Windows 8 laptop. To create Wi-Fi hotspot on your laptop, you need two NICs or network cards. Usually laptops have one wired and one wireless network adapter. You must have a working internet connection connected to wired network card. Here you can also use USB data card or dongle for internet connection. Second one that is wireless card will be used to connect to other networking devices like tablets and smartphones after the creation of hotspot. We also need Microsoft Virtual Wi-Fi Adapter. To create Microsoft Virtual Wi-Fi Adapter, we will use NetSH command with different options, contacts or parameters in administrator command prompt of your laptop. First command is displayed on your screen and it is NetSH space WLAN space set space hosted network space mode is equal to allow space SSID is equal to JST space Key is equal to JST 12345. Here, SSID is the name of your wireless network. Key is the password used by other users to connect their devices to your Wi Fi hotspot. Use some unique name as a SSID name and configure some strong network key or password. This command will create Wi Fi hotspot, but it will not start working automatically. To start Wi Fi hotspot, you need to type another command. And that is NetSH space WLAN space hosted network from the administrator command prompt of your laptop. After successful completion of these commands, we will have to share internet connection of wired network or USB data card dongle, whichever you are using in your setup with the Wi Fi network or hotspot. After discussing prerequisites and the activities we are going to perform in this video, let us move to our Windows 8.1 laptop to create Wi-Fi hotspot. Windows 8.1 is installed on my laptop. To go to Windows 8.1 desktop, we can click on desktop tile here or simply press Windows key on our keyboard. Now, I am on my Windows 8.1 desktop. Here, first I show you the network adapters installed on this computer. For this, we have to open network connections. To open network connections, I move my mouse pointer to the left bottom corner. Right click here and from context menu, select network connection. Here you can see that two network cards are installed on this laptop. Wired network adapter or Ethernet card is connected to internet and Wi-Fi is in disconnected state means not connected to any network. Now let's open administrator command prompt. For this I again move my mouse pointer to left bottom corner. Right click here and select command prompt admin from context menu to open administrator's command prompt. Administrator command prompt appears before you. Here we can type our commands. I start with NetSH command, but instead of typing the full command and its parameter, I show you how to take help for NetSH command. I type question mark after typing NetSH and press enter key. Here lots of contacts or options appears in front of you. Here we can see the sub contacts or option related to wireless LAN, that is WLAN. I type CLS to clear screen and type netsh wlan. Again you can type question mark here for help. Set command in this context that is wlan context sets the configuration information of wlan or wireless lan. Again type cls. You can take help in this way and press up arrow key twice of keyboard to display last commands typed or you can simply type netsh space wlan and after this set space hosted network space mode is equal to allow space SSID is equal to JST space key is equal to JST 12345.
you can use your own unique name as a SSID name and set some good password for your hotspot. After typing command, press enter key. A message appears confirming that the command runs successfully. SSID name has been changed successfully and key has been changed successfully. Now to start this hosted network or Wi-Fi hotspot, I am going to type the second command that is netsh space wlan space start space hosted network. This command will create Microsoft hosted network virtual adapter or connection here in network connections. Now I press enter key to execute the command. See the message appears that hosted network started and the Microsoft virtual adapter or connection for hosted network or hotspot is created and started successfully. Now let's share the internet connection of wired network with the hosted network or Wi-Fi hotspot. For this, I right click on Ethernet connection and click on properties from context menu. If you are using USB data card for internet, it also appears in network connections and you have to click on properties of that connection. On properties sheet, click on sharing tab. In sharing tab, we have an option of internet connection sharing. To share internet of this adapter, select allow other network users to connect through this computer's internet connection option. And from drop down list of home network connection, select the connection with which you want to share internet. In our case, it is local area connection 3 because it is our hosted network connection. Select it and click on OK button. You can see some more changes here. Ethernet connection is now shared one and SSID name of our hotspot appears here in local area connection 3. Therefore, the task has been completed successfully. Now, people having the keys or passwords of JST Wi-Fi hotspot can connect their devices like tablets, smartphones or laptops to this hosted network. In this video, we have learned the technique of turning our Windows 8.1 laptop into Wi-Fi hotspot. If you like the video, don't forget to press like button. To get latest videos information in your mailbox, subscribe to my channel. Hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching.